There's disturbing news tonight about the safety of our skies. The FAA reports the number of lasers pointed at airplanes nearly doubled last year. And that includes more than two dozen incidents right here in Tampa Bay. Our Donald Gourmets talked with pilots and passengers about the dramatic increase. Stu O'Shannon has flown hundreds of flights for the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office. But there's one he'll never forget. He was blinded by a laser at 500 feet. It's pretty amazing how such a little device can light up this entire cockpit and, and completely bind you temporarily. Sheriff's pilots say they've been lasered a half dozen times in the past year. But commercial jets are also reporting problems. 13 times at Tampa International in 2010, four times at St. Pete Clearwater. It's getting so bad that there's actually, FBI has one agent assigned to, to do nothing in this area but investigate lasering incidents. The number of cockpit lasering incidents set a record nationwide last year, with popular cities like Los Angeles, Chicago, Phoenix, Las Vegas, and Philadelphia reporting the most crimes. Tampa is not in the top 20. But if you're flying with your wife and baby like Travis Monday, that's little comfort. You know, there's so much crazy stuff in the world, and it seems like our security is doing well, but there's always new stuff. I mean, that's a surprise to me that that's going on. Never would have thought of it. Scary? It is scary. Deputies say the culprits are likely not domestic terrorists. Uh, probably just yahoos. These laser cases are very difficult for police because it's very hard to find the suspect. But once they do find them, the penalties could be severe because they go for federal time. Ten years in prison. In Tampa, Don Gourmet's ABC Action News.